Hello, good evening guys. Alessandra here again for another reaction. And uh, as one of you told me, uh, here we have uh, a very nice combination, especially if you're new to the channel, because we have an Italian woman from Sicily that in this moment and actually lives and works in London. And uh, is, uh, she's reacting to Latin America music in English. <laughs> and he was making fun of this guy about this crazy combination. And I found it very funny too. So thank you so much for the great response of my Spanish talk. It was very nice to send you this message of love. Thank you for all the support. And let me tell you something. I am, uh, thanks God, uh, very, very deep eradicated in my self-love. So any message of eight, uh, you know, the haters that I will have don't really affect me and my happiness. The only thing why I reported is, uh, you know, to put this guy in the spotlight and let him understand that uh, uh, be a hater, it doesn't go any good uh, to him. He is the one who will suffer to hate the others with no reason. And of course, I'm gonna keep on going on, I'm gonna keep on discover music all around the world. In this moment, we are in uh, South America. Uh, but yes, just uh, uh, let's enjoy this uh, a nice piece from Soda Stereo that you suggest me many times. I saw so many performances, the one from the concert in 1997, uh, the one from the concert in 2007, I guess he's uh, the one that Frank Varkia made uh, the reaction. So for this reason, because I wanted to enjoy this song with you, I decided to take this old, old live, probably from the 80s, uh, when I was a baby girl, because I, I, I was born in 1986. So let's enjoy together one of my favorite songs, Corazón de la Thor, let's start. Oh, they were so young. <laughs> Beautiful. Hello. Un señuelo. Hay algo oculto en cada sensación. And I lose my words. Desaparece oh, sus eyes. Parece descubrir. Debilidad, los vestigios de una hoguera. Oh, mi corazón se vuelve pegando. Dios, wow. Traicionando por descuido. Just let me enjoy another moment. De todo alguna vez. Ya no puede percibir, ya nada puede impedir. All right, let's let's stop for one moment, really, <laughs> because the song will keep on going on, and and we totally miss it. All right. Uh, this is one of my favorite songs uh, because the first time that I listened, of course, the first thing that caught my attention was uh, uh, the profound meaning of the lyric. And, um, you know, uh, I would like to read a little piece in English if you never heard about this song, but the, the atmosphere that the music creates uh, with this uh, particular sound uh, is uh, totally overwhelmed me, you know, it overwhelmed me. It's just like, you know, the perfect song to make love, I would say, um, for that kind of night. <laughs> and uh, as well here, Gustavo really show off about uh, his good skill as a writer. So just let's read something in English for the people who doesn't know Soda Stereo. Um, Caressly. I fell victim to everything sometime, 
She can perceive it now, nothing can stop it. In my fragility, it's the curse of things. Oh, my heart becomes a tattletale. tale. My handcuffs open. I mean, I guess I read so many times this lyric, either in Spanish and in English. What I perceive is that uh, uh, this song is about, uh, you know, inner feeling that you have inside your heart and uh, uh, that eventually this person uh, is starting to understand that this feeling, is starting to perceive it, you know. Like I said, she seemed to suspect, seems to discover in my weakness, you know, to remain as a bonfire, my heart become a tetami me and betray me. And sometimes happen in life, you know, our heart betrayed us. We want to hide the feelings, but they are more strong than us. They just need to come out, you know, to be discovered. Of course, if you have another interpretation or if you know the real meaning of the song, please share with me. It, this is how I take it. Uh, but you are teaching me so much about Soda Stereo and uh, Gustavo was a writer, so songwriter. So please just uh, just uh, share with me what do you think really about this song? What is the message that is behind? Let's continue. <laughs> So charismatic this You know, this light that just pointed to his eyes is not good to my heart. Crystal sound. This is Gustavo Cerati electric guitar sound. Oh. My dear. All right, let's stop here because I guess that now, uh, yeah, I will uh, start over again to sing. Um, he's an amazing guitarist. And uh, what I notice as a guitarist as well is that it's true. Uh, everybody and any guitarist is trying to build his own guitar, his own sound, to use particular pickups, to use particular, you know, effect. And uh, uh, it's lovely that even an, an electric guitar can define the personality of an artist. Uh, so as a guitarist, you know, time to time, I just need to listen how the electric guitar is played. And you understand if it's Brian May, if you understand if it's Jimmy Page, you understand as well if it's just a nice lovely song from the Beatles, you understand if it's this purple, you understand the if Mick Mars from Motory Crew and so on and so forth. And at the same time now I'm uh, um, perceive now Gustavo and the guitar of Gustavo are very personal, very uh, particular. And uh, again, I'm enjoying this version. Of course, it, it looks uh, and it sounds a little bit different from the latest that I saw, but still it was uh, a very outstanding performance. And, you know, uh, I can look to you a little bit quiet, but they are so good and this song is so enjoyable that, you know, I can just sit here in my bed and listen. That's it. Alone, in my solitude. And Gustavo, me and Gustavo, actually. You know, I'm in a good company. Let's continue. Señuelo, hay algo oculto en cada sensación que ya pareces escuchar, parece descubrir. Oh my God, this guy! He was so beautiful, this man. Que aquel amor, I don't want to find that love. Es como un océano de fuego. Oceano di fuoco. This 
sang. Oh my god, oh my god, he's so beautiful. Bravissimi. Oh my god. <laughs> meraviglioso, meraviglioso. Meraviglioso. Even this version I really enjoy it. It's a, it's a priceless song, one of my favorite of Soda and uh, yeah, beautiful. I hope you enjoy it with me as well. I don't know. Let me know who saw this performance before or if uh, uh, some of you are new to this performance and let's continue to talk. As I said, slowly, slowly, we will do all the song of Soda Stereo. So thank you so much for watching and stay tuned. More reaction are coming. Thank you. Bye.